In this segment, we're going to talk about how to hang the gallery wraps, the canvas wrapped around a wood frame. What I have here is a 16 by 24 fine art gallery wrap, one and a half inch depth here. And you see the image wrapping around there. It's just worth noting that we always have to add that extra image to the file so that it wraps around to the back. That is, this is a 16 by 24, but I need two inches in every direction. The file size that I send, hear me now, believe me later, needs to be 20 by 28. Two inches, two inches, two inches, two inches. Math is fun. Okay, now let's look around to the back. We're going to look at a couple of our different options, and we're going to actually hang them on the wall. We're starting with the wire hanger here. Note the open back. Okay, this is a question that we get a lot. This must have an open back. The reason being that the wire hanger you see is built into the frame itself. It is inside the level of the wood. Therefore, you cannot have a paper backing with a wire hanger. All right, and our other option for hanging is gonna be the sawtooth hangers. It's gonna be a little tricky to see it here on the black paper backing, but there are two sawtooth hangers up here on the top. This can be open in the back or it can have this black paper backing. The reason being that these sawtooth hangers are on the outside. So that's the difference in the hanging apparatus for the gallery wraps. Both of these options are going to have those bumpers down in the corners to make sure that this is vertically level on your wall. All right, we're gonna start by hanging our a wire hanger here. Let's head over to the wall and hang this up. Again, like with the wire hanger on framed print, it's probably the easiest way to do it, easiest way to tweak. So when I bring this thing over to the wall and then hang it onto my anchored screw or whatever it is, make sure you know your wall, what you're pounding into it, and make sure you've got that correct. So this is gonna hit here with the wire hanger. It's kind of a, a beautiful thing because if I need to tweak it, it's an easy tweak, right? The bumpers on the bottom are gonna give me that little breathing space so that it is vertically uh, level on that, okay? So we are gonna head back to the table and uh, let's take a look at those sawtooth hangers. All right, so now let's hang the sawtooth hangers. Difference here, as opposed to the wire hanger, of course, is that we're gonna have two hang points, and so we do have to be conscious of levels and things like that. So let's take it over to the wall. Otherwise, pretty simple, because the sawtooth hangers are over two inches wide, and so you've got your margin of error there. Uh, laterally, but vertically, you wanna, of course, make sure that you've hit it pretty well, and then Again, you can move it a little bit uh, right and left, but that's it. Also pretty easy to hang. So those are the hanging apparatuses for the gallery wraps.